my education background uh, like i'm coming i i i've done my uh, uh, engineering from rural engineer uh, rural uh, engineering college which was way back in 2008 and 9 so yeah after after that like uh, i pursued my masters uh, in uk uh, in, in in again uh, embedded uh, intelligent system so which is actually a non cs uh, uh, engineering uh, kind of a forte and then uh, post that i started my career there itself in uk worked about uh, two years two and a half years so after that like i moved back to india and then joined organizations like uh, uh, toshiba emc square and then uh, uh, and then currently i'm with the ibm uh, ibm so wherein like i've been working on the system side only most of my experience is on the system side yeah i was having a gap like uh, how do i uh, get through uh, this fang interviews like although i was able to make it to a few other companies uh, but the, to reach to the fang level preparation i was missing that gap so uh that i actually uh, uh ik journey helped me a lot in in terms of that the main obstacle i had was uh, manage uh, managing the time between my work life and uh, uh the interview preparation life uh, preparation time because uh i uh, see once you get into the interview preparation time uh, preparation mode so you your mindset has to be very clear so and then also the management of time has to be very important nowadays being uh, work from home anywhere that was easy for me to uh, squeeze that in little extra time but also uh, but also i should mention uh, uh, the ik uh, the study plan uh, and uh, how it like the, the the it was so well paced it definitely helped me allow me uh, allow me to uh, work on my skills uh, for example like ik had like some class problems uh, which we uh, which we are going which we are used to solve in the class and then some practice problems and then practice problems over the weekend we used to work i used to work on that and then also ik uh, ik had some more problems like a different set of problems on kind of variations on the problems which might uh, which, which could be asked on the similar line so that kind of a preparation i had and this kind of obstacles which cleared day by day basis not like just in one shot like everything was clear kind of preparation i had and also uh, the other uh, the issues I had was like uh, uh, definitely like uh, i had uh, fear uh, like uh, anxiety levels and then going into the how how would i do in interviews and all like so that definitely uh, almost reduced i would say because like uh, the mock sessions which uh, which i've attended during my uh, preparation time those really helped me like uh, mock sessions like uh, they definitely all the mock session mentors were all from the fang companies only so they really uh, gave valuable feedback after every mock sessions and that allowed me to improve on my uh, whatever uh, uh, the gaps or the, the mistakes i uh, I, i was doing in the mock sessions and then going for that that, that really helped me going forward into the the main interviews like so uh, that 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 reduce major amount of anxiety ness level and then fearness level uh, at all like yeah looking at my journey i think uh, i made a best decision of joining ik uh, in 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 a way like uh, it it really helped me uh, to understand and like uh, to learn more uh, on the distributed systems like because like i i'm coming from the non cs background uh, the ik curriculum really helped me to uh, 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 allowed me to uh, learn those all skills and then like uh, the floater sessions uh, re- related to all the distributed systems or a backend engineering those all really helped me to uh, understand how actually a really backend uh, works and then all the services microservices architecture really works and then uh, and then uh, uh, currently uh, at, at the, currently like i've received an offer from uh, suze uh, actually uh, for that position like i was been uh, i have been applying for uh, more than 2 years like uh, accidentally i looked back to my profile in the suze so since 2 years i was applying for that company and then uh, luckily uh, this time uh, i got a reach out from a recruiter for a, for a position at suze and then uh, and then the, re- the preparation amount i had like so i i was very confident student i can attend the interview with the suze and then and then uh, luckily or like uh, i i cleared it in my first attempt only the accomplishment level is like i would i should say like uh, i got a, a 100 plus uh, percent rise uh, so uh, from my uh, previous so i'm i'm pr- 
very much uh, very happy in terms of uh, monetary benefits and then plus uh, uh, apart from that like uh, there is a satisfaction level which i'm going into the role as well i'm talking i'm talking about the role here so uh, see uh, these many days i've been working on the system side now i'm i'm slowly making a transition towards uh, uh, application or a back end side so that uh, that uh, role is also very satisfactory uh, satisfactory for me as well rather than advice like uh, i w- i would say uh, it's a suggestion i would say if you have a really passion to work hard or uh, to reach your potential sometimes the people would not know their potential itself because uh, they think uh, uh, some of the companies are uh, way beyond their reach so it's not like that it's it's just a, a total myth uh, a, a, a everywhere it's floating around so we cannot clear those rounds like they are uh, it's the bureau so very tough it's not like that if you have a right set of mindset and the right set of guidance team team like ik definitely you can you can achieve your any goal like whatever you have goal you have in your mind you can definitely reach to that